And welcome back to Let's Play Xeno Gears. In the last episode, Bart and the Desert Pirate were fighting in their gears. And they sunk into a hole in the sand. Now they're in a cave. Oh, really? Did you? <laughs> and make no mistake, this is a massive cave. So the two are going to have to work together to get out of there. Meanwhile, back on the surface... Notice that soldiers got to keep their guns. I think they would have done something about that. Anyone need an abdominal operation? Need like pancreatic surgery or something? Or a gastric bypass? So he says. Who died this time? I imagine a lot of people died. I'll be able to come up somehow. Well, it doesn't really matter. If he fakes it, he makes it. <sighs> yes. Doc and Sigurd know each other. Notice how Sigurd also called Doc by a different name. Hyuga, or Hayuga, something like that. I'm not going to be calling him by that name, so it doesn't matter how I pronounce it. Now, here is the cave. Now, there'll be a save point right next to us where we start, and I'm going to save there. But I have to confess, there's a little bit of a mess up here. Oh, let's first take a look at Bart's stats. Notice he's just about the same as Faye. He's a little bit different, but he doesn't really outclass him the way Doc does. Now, in Gears, it's also a similar th thing. They're around the same, 
Bartski or Brigadier is a little bit of a higher attack power, but the other things are a little lower, just a little bit slower. The HP and everything is the same. Now, I have to confess a little bit of a mess up here. I'm not sure how this happened, but the video file I saved this on is corrupted. So I had to... Well, I could watch the video, but I couldn't edit it. So I had to capture the video playing when using Windows 9... Using Windows Media Player 9. And obviously you can see it didn't turn out that well. It's choppy. And there's no sound. Unfortunately, I have like 20 minutes of gameplay like this. So the next episode or two is going to be like this also. And I'm also hours beyond this part of the game without the save to go back to. So we're stuck with this. There's a big rock in the massive cave. You think how big that rock must be, how big the gears are, and they're small next to it. So, Faye and Bart are working together, pushing this boulder out of the way. Making it by if we help each other. Sesame Street here, people. Oh, Bart's gear is starting to break down. Won't be funny if my gear malfunctions in the UK for like this, this. Oh, no. You'll waste the time waiting. They probably won't come. Yeah, they don't give a crap about you. <laughs> oh, jeez. Both of these guys are relatively young. They're both 18 years old. And they're sort of whining to each other right now. Like children. What, you want some? Let's have it out, right here. How uh, mature of the two of them. Thank you very much. Now, the episode's going to come to an end in about a minute. But I'll have an opportunity to show you something. Something you can do in this game is have some characters in the gear and some characters out of gears. Now, right now, I have both my characters in gear. I'm going to take Faye out of the gear. Now, in a battle, you have both people in gears and out gears, out of gears, which meshes the two different fighting engines, and they work together rather well. See, here's a fight. Now, Faye's out of his gear, and Bart is in his gear. Now, what this gives me the opportunity to do is practice Faye's next death blow. Now these monsters are pretty easy, so I can defeat them even outside of gear, out of gears. The only problem is their attack power is high enough to kill you, kill a person in one hit. And they're relatively fast. Notice how Faye missed. But that brings to the end of this episode, so I'll see you next time. Or tune in next time.